50 degrees. Just a mud hole. Just a big old mud hole. Well, today we're putting in the heater, the milk house heater, and uh, I'll figure out where to put it. Uh, take this out today. Make some room here for a little bolt. I'm going to have to check the oil on this thing today. So there's a couple things on this tractor, or on a cab, that I noticed. Um, one of them is these, when I was using the backhoe yesterday, uh, this wouldn't shut. I don't know if it was just because the tractor was on the even. So I gotta do a few things. I'm not saying it's uh, the biggest problem in the world, but it's a problem nonetheless. I can't have that. So what I had to do. While uh, I was working, this pin, it screws in right here, you can see it, and I had to, had to uh, extend it, just unscrew it so that it would close tight, it would snap shut. So let's just see if it closes now, just run the heater. to see if it closes. No. That side closes, but this side don't. So, we're going to have to see if I can get a washer or two for that side. So I have to I don't want it loose, but if it, it's not just it just doesn't extend it out far enough, so I gotta I gotta find some washers. Let's see if we can fix it. No, I don't know. Thought, I had to put two washers in there. You can see this, you click these two knobs up here. Not a lot of lightning fine, but I had to put two washers in there to extend extend this out. You can see my hand but uh, two washers because this was hitting here and it wouldn't shut. So now two washers later. Perfect. So I'm gonna also check the oil. There's another thing that I, I noticed on this pad here, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get the light out, but here, also, either the CNY did it, I'm not sure who did, but here, I don't know if you can see in there, but there's two screws, you can see them, just really small screws, and they're stripped, I know they must have done it when and they were putting it together, they stripped them. So here, you know, driving down the road, you have this kit to the windshield open. Rattle, because these are stripped. So I have to find nuts for them. And tighten them, because there's, there's, there's no, no tightening them. It's these these ones right here. You can see where my finger is. That those two little screws. 
So when, you, when you're going down, you have this windshield open. See it? It's just loose. There's no tightening them. I tried. Those tighten really tight. These they put these on and stripped them. But there's not much I can do with top. But maybe you can see in here. Now I have to get them out somehow and then put little nuts on them. There's nuts. So that's two things I found that you know it's just adjustments. I did find a leak in the radi or uh, these hoses up in the in the engine compartment, um, but I tightened them, so this is fixed. You can see the now maybe you can see the uh, two washers ahead. See this is out too far that piece, and uh, but well, and so it wouldn't close. I was like, what the heck? I couldn't figure that out yesterday. I was like, oh, oh something's broken. But what it is, it's just, you know, just an adjustment. So I put, like I said, I put, I put washers in there. And maybe other people would take their tractor back and say, oh, this isn't right. But as far as I'm concerned, it's just, you know, it's nothing big. So you take that off when you're doing this, and um, I don't know if you have to actually close the hood or the windshield or not. Let's see if it'll stay here. Put it in the hand. I'm going to check them again. Uh, these these valves, I'll just take a, a screwdriver and make sure everything's tight again. Now these engines, when they're running, if you ever open your hood and watch it, they, they shake pretty hardcore. But I don't see any leaks. Looks good. Actually, I do. I'm going to get my, uh, I'll, uh, what I'm going to do is, um, use a ratchet on them and then tighten them up really good because the screwdriver, you just can't, you know, get right in there. But, well, there's a lot to this. You can see there's one here, one, two, three, four, five clamps alone here, and then they have the shutoff valve. Here. This one was loose, and I finally got found just the right thing. Well, this is it here, and I was able to get in here. You know, just tighten it. I can't get in there with anything else, and I got it tight though. I got all these tight, and I had to take the air cleaner, just loosen it up. And, so I could get at these, I should have changed the direction, but I didn't, so. You know what? See. So then, uh, because of that, I need to add, because it was leaking, I guess, I need to add radiator fluid. I think I have some. All right, so that's full. One thing about these smaller tractors, right? Very hard, everything's pretty close. But all right, man, so put back together. We got radiator fluid in there. Everything's tightened up. 
good with oil fixed our little problem here maybe with the light you can see it's right there right here you can see that this piece right here was in too far and this clamp was just hitting it so it wouldn't close so I extended it with two washers those right right you can see how it fits right here it just fits in there so you have to squeeze it in make sure it's, and make sure that line right there is in this little notch it is same with the other side Check that out. I gotta check that out. This side goes in real nice. That side has a problem. It's not bad. I could do a I could uh, do, not have to deal with anything like that, but it's okay. Alright, so then you gotta put this in. This little flapper. I lied to you, it's just I line up the, uh, oops, there's my light. I just line up the the um, I'm gonna hang this thing. I'm gonna hang it there. Pretty much just um, goes in here. Snap the snappers in. Snap it, we snap. And line them up in there pretty much. In anyway. There. Now she's on. It's a little doing, but you know, it keeps the tractor from, you know, the air can get in everywhere. So they do it right, you know, you just snap that in and, you know, they're good, you know. Okay. Yeah, she's in. Okay. Well, anyway, <laughs> that took a lot. So everything's back to normal. Okay. 
And now back to other things. The, the things I did, I was, I came here to do. Figure out how to. I'm just gonna cut that. And get this shit situated. Well, I gave her a little bath. It's so muddy. Just driving back in here was kind of crappy, but gotta keep them clean, you know.